Not worried about the sunshine. Mm. Mm. Couldn't care less about the rain. Mm. Mm. All we need is YouTube to upload our games. Mm. Mm. We shut all the curtains mm -hmm. and turn off all the lights. And now that we've got time to record some more stuff. <laughs> to record some more stuff. <laughs> Can you see it? Hi guys and welcome back to me, Grandpa Diddly, for some more Diddly Diddly Gaming. And today I'm going to do a little test, okay? This is for people that are quite new to PCs. They don't, they, they play like Playstations and Xboxes and Nintendos and stuff like that. And they they just want to know, can they get a, um, a simple setup without too much hassle you know like they can just get a, a decent laptop because this is what this is a test on right this is a laptop a mobile laptop that basically can it handle the power of something quite powerful and doing like a vr or something like a rift s okay what what is it like is it is it going to be complicated are you going to try it and it just doesn't run you know it's no good so you just want to know will it work so as you can see i'm going to get straight into this video and as you can see i've got a geforce gtx 170 okay and it's eight gigs and it's an i7 right now i'm doing this test so it's quite straightforward no sort of tempering around with settings and stuff it's all just ba basic now this is geforce experience let me get rid of this okay now on here when I press Alt and Z, I can actually record my footage, which I'm doing now, at the same time as playing this process and player. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a test showing what it's like on the battery, just the battery power, okay? And then do a test on what it's like on the mains power on the same game, and then do a test on the Rift S playing it in VR. And then you can see, so what I'm going to do, I'm recording, as you can see, this is recording. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you, if I go back to um, the GeForce experience, okay, now what I'm going to do here is I'll show you the settings. Now, this is the VR version. This is the uh, normal version. So I'm going to do the normal version first. I'll go details right now. You can see here it says on battery, and it's got like current settings and optimized settings, right? So I've actually currently got it on optimized, right? I'm going to optimize it. Now plugged in, you can see it's it's more power and I've got it optimized again, okay? If I want to revert it back, all i got to do is press revert and it will go like down to eight and stuff like that, right? But if you go, if you look on the left, right hand side, you'll see that it says 16 and so on and so forth okay but this is just playing it as it is right um so you want you want to know if it's simple you don't want to be changing stuff so all i've done is optimize to what it says okay now i'm going to play the game right now for this game i've got the xbox controller at the moment okay i ain't now what i've done i go settings okay i've got everything set up and you'll see here display and everything's the way it set it up for me, okay? You haven't got a tamp. I'm not going to tamp with anything yet. I'm just going to show you what the power is like, okay? So, as you can see, if we just look here a sec. Okay, everything is done the way it wants to. So, we're going to jump into a game. And I'm going to put the most cars on the track, okay? Jump on, come on. Yep, so I got a Nizan I got a Nizan day set up, okay? Um and then I'm just gonna change I'm gonna take this strength down a bit here because let's just change it down. I got twenty three opponents, okay. Now I'm gonna start the game. Ah, I got the sound. I can hear it. I put it on 7.1 surround, virtual surround on as well. 
Right, okay, now. What we're gonna do, we're gonna hop straight in. We're not gonna miss around. Let's have a look. See how it handles. Let's see. Right. As you can see, that just delayed. Just go around a little bit here. Oh God. Whoa. Whoa, he nudged me, he nudged me. God damn it. playing the whole thing, okay, is that's just to show you what it's like with, you know, all of the cars on the track. Now, you saw, you saw there, that at the beginning, it went mental, okay, when it froze and everything, okay? Now, I'm going to show you a little thing here. If I go back, exit, so now, this time, what I'm going to do in settings, okay, there's one thing here, ultra settings was on, okay? This is smoke generation. Now, let me just take that down a minute to off. Or, no, not off, sorry. Very low, okay? Let's see with the same track at the beginning. Let's see with just that one change, okay? Get it true to life comparison. Let's get over here. Let's have a look. Now let's see how we get on at the beginning with very low smoke. There you go, look at that. That was better. Stop there, let's stop there. Okay, again. So all I did was I altered the smoke. Yeah, right, okay. So let's go on here and let's put it up to it was on ultra high normal. Okay, should we go normal? Because it was on very low. Let's try and let's try halfway. Let's see what that's like. Okay, so we're here now. Right, so... We're gonna try it on normal now. Right, let's see how we get on. See if it delays. Yes. A little bit of a delay. Okay, so we know there was a slight... Just a slight delay okay now I think judging from what we've seen this is still on uh, thing I think that the lowest we can go on battery is low that's without any stutter at the beginning let's try it because we were on very low before so let's try low okay let's see if we don't get any delay at all here we go. I'd say that was good. Now we know that's our first test, okay? We've done our first test. Now I'm going to skip. And we're going to try it with the plug on to see if we can improve it at all, okay? Anything changes or whether it's that smoke that affects it all the time, okay? 
So that was on battery. Here we go. We're going to stick skip over onto plug. Okay, guys. So now we got it plugged in. Okay. So I'm just going to show you, as you can see down at bottom, it will say "so long to charge." Down here, 18 minutes. Okay. So we got 20, 18 minutes till it's fully charged. Now, as you can see, if we go optimal and plug in. Okay, so now we've optimized it for plugged in. Okay, now we're going to launch the game. Just double check, 16 and 4, yep. And we check the effects. And you can see it's on ultra, smoke generation. So we're going to do the same cars, everything, okay? Okay, now let's just load it in. Let's see if we get any freezing. Oh yeah, yeah. So that's what we needed to check. We know that that smoke is still even on a plug-in, because obviously other settings are higher now. So let's get rid of that. And what we do? We'll see if we can just drop it down in normal, okay? Because normal didn't work before. It had to just a tad bit of, just the most tiniest part. Here we go. Let's see if that normally works or not. <laughs> Sorry. But I got a feeling that the night, no, 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 I get a feeling that if we go higher, um, I think normal was pretty good on smoke. But if we just go one higher to high, not ultra, I think that's going to be pushing it a bit. I think that we need to be on normal. So we established that if we're on normal smoke, at the moment, I'm plugged in, we're okay. But if we're on uh, low on battery, then we're okay there too. Do this on a laptop, and you don't have to worry about things. The graphics are amazing though, but I've got to show you the Rift S, so we can see the same thing, and if the smoke generation makes a difference. Here we go. No delay. Different. I'm just going to stop there. The different delay. Okay. So the final test then. We got one final test now. And that is the Rift S. Will the Rift S be able to handle the power? Or should I say. Will this laptop. With the 170. Be able to handle the power. With optimized settings for the Rift S. And just changing that bit of smoke, can it handle it? Will you be able to buy a laptop and you won't have to worry too much? Or will it just not handle it at all? Let's skip over to the Oculus Rift S and we'll see. Okay, so I've optimized the settings. Let me just double check. Okay, so using optimal settings, okay? So I've done that on plug-in and now I'm going to play it. Let's have a look at the settings here. Uh, Oculus Rift rendering. There uh, we got 8 and 2. Was that set to 8 and 2? I can't remember. I'll have to look back, but well, it's optimized for the Oculus anyway. Look, we'll see what happens. What's the uh, smoke on? 
smoke is on high. Okay. Takes a bit of loading. Let's see if it it stutters. This is plugged in on the Oculus Rift S. Don't want to drive sideways unless I'm drifting. Okay. Let's see if we get the smoke. Oh, this is so good in VR. It's so much bigger and better. Ah, we got a bit of... Tell you what, I'm not kidding you, right? Just looking around, look at this. I just gotta show you this a second. Look, it's just incredible. Look at this. You got the cars behind you. I mean, it's just, it's just incredible. When you're playing it in VR, it's so much different to playing it on a normal screen. It just feels so realistic. It's unbelievable. You really have to try it. smoke generation so normal was what it was okay on um, and we got this and this you know everything let's, let's just try with the smoke on normal see if it delays and then um, you know just little tinkering with the old uh, smoke there as you could see let me just I love this game though. This is a set of Corsa. Just a little bit of delay still. It's, the smoke generation still played up, didn't it? Let's, let's go a bit lower. Let's go one lower on the smoke to see if it still does that. Yeah, where was it? Yeah, well, no, 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 it does show there on 8 and 2. I thought it was 16 because that was what it was on the, um, not on the VR version. Okay, so let's get rid of this. And let's go here and let's just see if this is actually the case. Let's go down to low. Because low was on the battery power of the stand version, but obviously with different settings. But I just want to change that smoke, because that seems to be the thing that slows it down at the beginning. That seems to be the biggest thing. So I just want to see if that's the case. I just love this, this game. Yes, it was a smoke, because... Even then, it was fine. I wonder if I can up... Can I up anything? Hang on a minute. So let's try... Um, that's 200 FPS frame rate limit. Um, it's 16, 8, 2... Uh, Four, two or four. So I put them both up high and see what happens. It could go completely pear shaped, but you know, who cares? I just want to see what it can handle. Now this might not go well, I don't know. Let's have it. Oh no, I can do it with it. Oh no, I can't now, can I? No, I have to use this now. Let's see if it...
Whoa! Oh, Jesus! Did you see the way he hit me? Fourteen. I turn them up. Maximum world detail. High shadows, but you know they were on two and these. But man, even that was fantastic. Anyway, guys, I mean, what do you think? Did you think the uh, laptop? Handled well, the HP Omen um, i7-1070 laptop. Do you think that having them on them settings, I could have done more, I could have reduced more, I don't know. But do you think they're good enough to play a VR game like that with all of those cars on the track? I don't know. You decide. Anyway, guys, until next time, diddly diddly. We are trying to know see how we get on it. We get it very see how we handle this. See how we get on it. See if it delays. Here we go. Yes. A little bit of a delay. Look at that. As you can see, there was better than just. I love this game. This is so good in VR. It's so much This is a set of Corsa. Just ah, a little bit of delay still.